Minecraft 1.17 has added a ton of new blocks, many of which can be used in very unique ways. Today, I'm going to show you 10 of the best build hacks for Minecraft 1.17 Caves and Cliffs update I found. My name is Legend, and let's get started. Starting off with candles and lightning rods, which can actually be combined in a lot of unique ways. First, I put two lightning rods on top of each other, as well as a candle, to create sort of a candlestick thing. I think it looks very nice, and the copper is kind of the perfect color for it. I've also made this taller candle using the up lightning rod this direction, and an orange candle on top. I think that also looks pretty nice. Next are azalea trees and the moss. Moss and azalea bush have actually a very, very similar texture, so stacked on top of each other, they can actually make a nice, sizable, great looking bush. You can even add some of the, the carpet or the moss carpet around to make it look even better. I think this is a great bush design and stacking them on top of each other. I think this could look very cool in any sort of like garden build. Next up is the design you've probably seen before and it's sort of like an amethyst lamp. Most people put amethysts on the inside. I actually put sort of a sea lantern on the inside to give it a bit more light because it's a lamp. I think either work. Both of the textures mix pretty well, so I think it's a pretty good looking lamp. You can just have it hanging high up in your big build, and I think that's a pretty nice design right there. The next one is even cooler for light. We're going to use a little moss carpet here, and if we set the time at night, you can see that this area is actually glowing. Why? Well, if you look under this moss block, we can actually see I have hidden a light source. And when the carpet is placed back on top, you can still see the light source, so the entire area is lit up. You, we used to have to do this with leaves or green carpet, but I think the moss carpet does it so much better. Now here's an interesting thing for the lightning rod. The lightning rod actually reminded me a lot of like a prison cell or like prison bars. So if we just go inside the prison real quick, we can see that these actually look very well for prison bars, except they don't. But you can basically, it's just for looks, okay? It's not the best prison. And for design number something, we've got this cool azalea bush design. I've gotten a flower pot with a little azalea bush on top, and then we put some moss on top. It's a nice, really cool tree design. I'm definitely going to use this in more of my builds. It looks kind of like a bonsai tree. It looks very, very cool. Look at this red candle here. Does it look familiar? It shouldn't until you see this. Look how much the red candle looks like dynamite. And mixed with TNT, you can create a nice little scene, a nice little pile of TNT and dynamite. Even throw in some of the items on the ground. This looks so good. And I've combined TNT minecarts, regular TNT, and the red candles. You can even light the red candles, and even you could light the TNT if you wanted, but nope. Not gonna do it. Uh, stick around to the end of the video, and I'll do it. Next is kind of an overlooked block, the glow lichen. You know how cobblestone has a mossy variant, and same with stone bricks, but not a single other stone has a mossy variant. That didn't make sense to me, but then I realized we can use this glow lichen along with other stone variants and create nice mossy variants of it. You can use vines for this, but the vines are just too dense and they kind of hide the block. I think this looks so much better. And you can even use this for blending and stuff. The glow lichen is actually a very nice block and I've used it in many of my builds recently. Our next design here is another lamp. This one using blackstone, a smooth polished blackstone, some chains and some candles on top to make this nice little chandelier. This turned out really nice. I like this design and there are so many different things you can do with this. This is just one example. You can change out the wall thingies. You can change out the candle. In my opinion, candles are one of the best blocks added in 1.17. Now for our final design. This is a grandfather clock using the brand new lightning rod. This looks just like one of those hanging bells. I didn't even realize until I did this. This is very, very interesting. This is a very unique design and I think it looks great for it. Before we've had to use other things like chains or bell, actual bells and stuff like that, but now with this clock, the glow item frame, the clock retexture looks amazing. Now it's gone. Oops. But 
but I'm very happy with this. Uh, oh, I'm destroying. I'm destroying all of it. Uh, we'll just move on now. We'll just move on now. And nope, I didn't forget. Let's. Oh no, this is gonna destroy a lot. And boom, boom. All right, good. It didn't damage anything else, and it's not over yet. Well, anyways, thanks for watching.